Hello guys, my name is Adrian Kogier from Smarter Media Org, and today I have a lesson on math, and this is at the very, very basic level of math, starting with addition. Addition is one of the very first things you learn in math alongside subtraction, and it's one of the most basic forms of math that leads into many, many more advanced topics. So, again, this video is starting off with the math chapter of our uh, many more to come, you know, the library of content we wish to build upon. So this, again, is for very basic uh, you know, learning and, you know, for kids and stuff like that, if uh, you want to show this in terms of tutorial, uh, explaining it the most basic and most simplest way I can. So first off, let's start off talking about what is addition. Uh, and addition is formalized by the Chinese, it was formalized by the Chinese about 6,000 years ago. And before then, we used to use counting and number lines, and traditionally, you know, we use counting with our fingers or objects, and then we used number lines, which uh, symbolized things like we would be able to draw a number line like so and we would have again numbers on it with dashes so we would have one two and then would you know so on and then we would count by adding on like so all right now addition and how to add is very very basic the def definition of addition is adding something to something else so let's say for example you have two objects here so in this case we have two squares uh, and on the other side we have one square so if I wanted to take one square and move it over to the other side, we now have two squares on this side. So again, one, two, the very most basic form of addition, adding something to something else. In that very aspect, if I took this square and dragged it over here, you would have three squares now on the right side. So again, and if I was to take uh, any other squares and add them onto the side, you would keep on adding on one, two, three, four, five, etc. So that's the very, very basics of addition and how to add. You're basically taking one thing and taking it over to something else. There's a variety of ways to add, and one of the common ways that we see is using a number line. So if you've ever seen this before, you can, you know, using dashes. So this represents one, and then we have two, three, four. So there's four lines, and when we get to the fifth, we throw a dash through it to symbolize five. So this is representing the number Five, like the fingers you have on your hand. Again, if you continue on, you go six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So this now represents ten if you're counting by fives. So in addition, you can add to a variety of ways. You don't have to necessarily go in chronological order, you know, one, two, three, four, five, but you can actually count by a certain interval. So for example, again, five, ten, and again, if you add another one, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So now we have. 15 lines using uh, this method and again you can add in many many ways and just to show you a, another example we have these boxes here so a very very basic example here so if you're watching and uh, you know you're trying to teach your kid addition or anything of that matter so a very basic example that is used a lot is so you have these two boxes here now how many circles are in this box box we're gonna call this box one right here so this is box one uh, how many circles are in this box? So we have one, two, three. So we have three circles in this box right here. This is box one. Again, three, box one. All right, so this is box one. Now in this circle, box two, how many circles do we have in box two? And you can clearly see there's one, two. So we have two circles in box two. So I'm going to write two in this one. Now we have two and three. And this is how we add using uh, shapes or any objects. You take this, you count the numbers, and then you have three and two. So much like using your fingers, if you have three and you add two, these two numbers right here will give you five. Again, much like using your fingers, you have three fingers, or again, using lines, whatever way you want to add. You have three dashes here, and then you want to add two. Uh, you can go you know, adding two, and then you can count these lines. You can do the dash, whatever way you want to add. There's a variety of ways to add, and again, this is the very, very most basic form of mathematics leading into many other topics, expanding into subtracting or subtraction, multiplication, and division, which are a little bit more uh, basic into upper level topics that will lead you into algebra, etc. I thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I hope it was simple and basic enough uh, for those who are getting into mathematics or trying to give a guideline to anybody who is starting, you know, learning math. Uh, again, this is from smartermedia.org productions. You can check out our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash smartermediaorg, twitter.com slash smartermediaorg, and email us for any contact information, etc. at smartermediaorg at gmail.com. 
Thanks for watching. Hope to check out the other tutorials. Enjoy.